Let's take a look at how you can view multiple representations of data using the TI Inspire. So I've already entered some data into the List and Spreadsheet page where I've entered the grades for a test that was just given and then the gender of the individual who took that test. So I want to see what this looks like as a distribution of data. So I'm going to insert a new page on the data and statistics and I'm going to plot the grades first. So notice I now have a distribution of what the grades look like for this particular test. But in order to analyze it a little better, I want to change the view so that it's a box plot so that now I can see the median grade and then to see where the quartiles are for this set of data. Well, because I recorded the male-female breakout for this test, let's change this so that instead of I'm looking at the whole class, I want to see the differences in grades between the males and females of the people that took this test. So notice I can see the difference in the median grade for the females versus the median grade for the males and where that lies on this range of grades. And if I wanted to make it a little nicer, I could change the color of these graphs just so that it looks a little nicer on the page. How these box plots are affected when I move certain data points in these sets of data. So what would happen to the median score as different points are moved? So give it a try. You can try the TI Inspire for free by downloading the TI Inspire software from our website, education.ti.com.